Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I am here doing um, a random collective reading. This reading is for the collective, so you know, just take what resonates, toss out the rest, right? Don't try to force it. And thank you so much everyone for all the likes, the subscribes, everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Thank you so much for all of your support. I truly, truly mean that. All right, so also, um, you can be any sign for this reading, okay? Um, it's not for any specific sign, so if you were led to this to this reading, it, there's something in it for you. Um, so like I said, though, just take what resonates, toss out the rest, right? All right, Divine, what do you have for the collective tonight? What do you have? What messages in love? Okay. Well, someone's coming out of the hangman position. Okay, they're still feeling a little stuck wherever they are, though. Um, yeah, all they've been doing is thinking, thinking, thinking about this, just stuck in their mind. But now they finally get it. <laughs> this is kind of like, it took me a while, but I finally get it. Okay. Um, yeah, they're seeing how they really, wow, this, yep, that's what they're thinking about. How they betrayed you, lied to you, um, played little games with you. I feel like what this person did, collective, in the past, you're dealing, you could be dealing with the Pisces, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, uh, Virgo energy, okay? Um, I feel like what this person did was they got you to fall in love with them. They did this with a lot of people. They got you to fall in love with them, okay? And then, and by playing you, in and out energy, um, uh, flirting, uh, being intimate, okay, um, they played you. They came in really fast and hot, and they left just as fast, okay? Um, and they sat here, feeling all smug, hoping you would come and chase after them, kind of like everybody else, how everybody else would do, right? It was a game. It fed this person's ego. Um yeah they just sat on this they could have they could have said goodbye but it, it could have been something harsh this person could have treated you really mean in the past said mean things inconsiderate this just seems like a very inconsiderate person who saw people's hearts as little tokens okay um that's really the feeling that i'm getting this all happened really fast i feel like this person came in really fast and cut you off really fast came in to get what they wanted, lied, they totally planned this. This is something that was pre-planned. This is something they've done with others. Okay, um, yeah, and they could have had you in a mental mind trap too over this for a long, long time. Um, so yeah, this person, they pre-planned it. They knew what they were doing. Um, an opportunist maybe, definitely lies and, and betrayal here, okay? And then they would smile about it. Look, in, in each photo, this person is smiling. Here, where they're smug, waiting for you to talk to them. Here, knowing they'll get away with something. You know, I don't know why people think that it's okay to treat another human being that way. But um, now this person is looking back on all of this. Okay, feeling ashamed as, you know, to how they treated you, right? Their behavior. They're thinking about this. They spend long hours thinking about this. Um, you know, I feel like thinking about it so intensely, they're, they're, they're feeling to me like they're on shutdown mode with the hangman and this hermit. But they're definitely seeing the light here. They're shedding the light on their own stupid behavior. <laughs> You know, yeah, and look at now it's like they want you back. Look at this. Now they freaking miss you. Bottom of the deck. Um, yeah, you're their ten of cups. You know, honestly, for some of you, this person, uh, they could have gotten married. And if that's the case, they're still thinking about you. Yeah, with this on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, this person could have gone and gotten married to somebody else. And they're still thinking about you. They're missing you. Um, and this person hid a lot from you. So they could have already been married. 
in a home situation with a family and everything. I, I, I just feel like this was a player, a cheater. Um, yeah, definitely somebody who cheated you out of clear thinking for years, perhaps. Yeah, I feel like you've broken free from that now, though. You got your justice all on your own. Um, yeah, once again, Pisces energy. Okay, I feel like this person wants to come forward to you now. Um, they may be trying to balance out their, their emotions here, or this could be manifesting your soulmate connection to come back together. But I feel like you've turned the other way. You're, you're, you're saying goodbye to this connection. You're ending it here. Stepping into a whole new lifestyle for yourself. Very well balanced, wrapped in intuition. Look at how gorgeous you are. You know, you're just beautiful. It seems like you could be even in the public eye here. All eyes are on you. This is, uh, you, you could be dealing with the Pisces. I've got Virgo out here. I've got Libra out here too, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, I feel like when this person met you, they thought that you may be a little bit naive, okay? Because you were very innocent in all of this. You would have never hurt this person. You were telling them the, the truth. They were hiding stuff from you. They did it on purpose. I feel like they saw you as like somebody who would be very naive and easily accepting of them, which you were, I feel you accepted them for who they were. You looked up to this person, you did. You didn't know they were coming and playing you though. I feel like you trusted them and they broke your trust. And I feel like now um, to balance these scales, this person has to come in now, make an apology, right? But uh, I feel like you're turning away from that. You, you don't want this person to come with you into this new cycle. And now you're, you're abundant, okay? You've got nine pinnacles here. You're single. You're happy on your own. I feel like uh, the scales have been balanced for you, not with love. You know, you, you have the one pinnacle you don't have. That stands for a partnership, somebody um, that you can build something solid with, a ten of pinnacles, right? Um, but I feel like you got your justice in the form of abundance here and new opportunities, healing, and the ability to leave the situation that kept you stuck in, in a mental mind trap. You know, I feel like you've healed. I feel like you've healed. And you know that this person, you know, maybe when you first met this person, um, you could have known them like, for years and years and years too, you know, very young here. But when you met this person, you may have accepted this apology, but if there's a fish in that cup, now I feel like you've grown, you've worked on yourself, you've learned your lessons here. Yeah, I feel like you, you want a new beginning and this person, um, they're losing sleep at night. They want to choose something new now, see? They want to choose something new. Um, clarify this King of Pentacles here for the collective. Divine, clarify this King of Pentacles for the collective, please. Yeah. I feel like this person, in order to come towards you, and have, you know, if they want a new beginning with you here, they're in a lot of regret. They would have to walk away from something here. And I feel like they're not quite emotionally ready to do that. Um, could be dealing with the water sign. Heavy on Pisces, guys. We're real heavy on Pisces right now. What else can you show me? Clarify this again. I feel like this could be of somebody who has a family, you know. Um, they could also be listening to other people, making them feel guilty for feeling this way. I feel like they're, yeah, they're with somebody else here, collective, that's watching them. 
okay they're watching people are watching and they're whoever they're with can see that they want to come towards you once again temperance angel on the bottom of the deck this soulmate connection wants to be um it's almost like this was supposed to this connection was supposed to come together i keep seeing that temperance angel mixing it up you know yeah i feel like somebody um someone could have told whoever they're with i feel like there's some kind of gossip or somebody else comes into the picture here and spread some kind of rumor or something that they want to come towards you that this person wants to come towards you feel like somebody else is involved here though this page of wands energy yeah, that there's a rumor or something that's going around here about um, this connection that they're in. They could even, I don't know, this could be a younger person, maybe um, could even be like a son, right? Or a daughter or uh, somebody younger that comes and talks about this. It's, it's like the secret's out. And everything crumbles really suddenly here because of this. What is that all about? Yeah, it's like somebody comes in and feeds somebody some information here about something. Or there could have been some kind of sp spell work done too. There's a, something's coming out. Some kind of piece of information is going to come out about this person wanting to come towards you. And that kind of, I mean, it causes a very sudden tower moment, a lot of chaos, a big shakeup. Okay, what else can you show me here? Somebody's going to come and, and, and tell whoever they're with that they're not happy um, in the situation, that they want to maybe give to someone else, that they want to come towards you with this Two of Cups. That's the Two of Cups that that Temperance Angel keeps mixing up, okay? This one. Yeah. You could be dealing with the fire sign. This, you know, uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. This King of Wands, they go after what they want. I'm telling you, somebody's going to come. At, yeah, that they're leaving here. They're leaving the scene. I feel like this person is going to be moving on. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Virgo. What is this? Somebody finds out the truth. Someone finds out the truth. Um, honestly, it, yeah. And then somebody gets very enraged, very enraged. This Queen of Swords energy, once they get the truth, they're going to want revenge. They're going to want revenge in this situation, okay? Um, I feel like they're going to have some really harsh words to say. This is somebody who kicks up a major storm. Um yeah very cutting with their words too it's like they're saying some harsh stuff okay yeah there's other options i feel like this person tried to keep this connection sort of hidden here but it's coming out i feel like they tried to keep it hidden from the, whoever they're committed to but it is coming out somebody else knows about this this page of wands changed the whole game. This could also be somebody who may have an STD as well from their player activity because you know they've been with a lot of cups. So that could be it right there. I feel like, yeah... Yeah, with the King of Wands here, that's the master uh, schmoozer in the deck. As, 
you know, from what I can see. Yeah, this person could, they could actually have an STD here. They may have given given this Queen of Swords something. It, oh boy, she's mad. Once this information comes out with the Ace of Swords here, oh boy, she's mad. Queen of Swords in reverse. Yeah, she's going to find out about other options for sure that way. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's kind of one of the scenarios here, guys. The other one is they find out some kind of information from somebody else, maybe somebody younger, maybe some kind of gossip. And uh, yeah, that this person's going to come towards you. Making a decision when it comes to love. This person's going after their wish. So be very careful, collective, okay? Because, I'm, you know, I've got two scenarios here. One is that this Queen of Swords finds out from somebody younger or some kind of gossip or some kind of news that comes in, right? That this person wants to go somewhere else. That causes a fight. And, and the tower comes down, okay? Because this person's making a decision. And then I've got another scenario where this person may have gotten an STD. They are a player. They've been in a lot of cups. This is sometimes an STD card for me. And we've got a Queen of Swords who is really wanting some revenge. Okay? So, yeah, take it how it resonates. I've got, I literally have two separate scenarios out here. Um, yeah, two separate scenarios, okay? Two separate scenarios. Either way, there's going to be a freaking fight, okay? Either way, there's going to be a fight. Um, and I feel like your advice is to stand in your strength, in your boundaries, okay? Um, this is hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil, right? So you're not a part of this. Um, you've already said goodbye to the situation and ended the cycle. You've learned your lesson from this person. I feel like you're clean. That's really the feeling that I'm getting here is that you're clean. Um, and, but this person's got bad health, guys, I'm telling you. Bad health. Yeah. That because of the overuse of their wand. Look at all the wands. Oh, boy. Yeah, the, the, uh, this is very bad health. And it could be something they can't get rid of, too. So be very careful at this time. All right? Clarify this Ten of Swords for the Collective. Seriously, guys, I've got two scenarios Two scenarios, use your discernment, okay? All right, what else can you show me for the collective? And this isn't going to be for all of you. Um, you know, you could be an Aquarius, you could be a Leo, Taurus. Your person could be a Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, heavy on Pisces. Um... Virgo, Aries, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio. Yeah, there's a judgment call being made on this. You know, I got to say, I feel like it's happening to every sign, okay? It's the end of the cycle and a judgment call is being made or has to be made. And I feel like this person has messed with this connection so much, they've screwed up. If this is somebody with an STD, they've screwed themselves up here, okay? And it's going that way to me. Like, that's what I'm leaning towards, that it looks like an STD, health issues, overuse of their wand. It's all coming back on them. Okay, the STD card, right? The player energy with all of the cups. Come on, you know? Um, so, yeah, I feel like um, a judgment call must be made on this situation. The divine is closing the door on this person, collective. 
the the door is closing. I'm seeing this as a big giant metal vault door. Um, yeah, and that's why I feel like you're being divinely led intuitively to block this energy out. Um, and underneath that is that false uh, that false apology. Okay, with the with the fish in the cup. Yeah, so I feel like this person, they can't come towards you now. They can't come towards you or get to you where you are. And they're, they're, they haven't even really started doing their work. They're just seeing clearly right now. Okay? Right now. But it's a little too late for this person, especially if they've gotten an STD from, from their player ways, right? New beginnings are going to be gifted to you, um, collective. <laughs> well, I almost called you divine. But this is a divine gift. You're going to be gifted with a, a new beginning. And I feel like whatever blessing this person had going to them is going to be coming to you. I, I see this as a lot of abundance as well. Like a lump sum of money, something like, look, it's going to put you in the Queen of Pentacles throne. Extremely financially stable. Okay, nurturing something of your very own, possible boss here, business owner. You're going to be focusing on a happy home life, happy family. You're going to be focused on, on putting your energy into things that are going to grow. All right, you're going to have this new beginning here. The divine is, is uh, the wheel of fortune is turning. The door is closed on this person at this time, okay? Um, and you're moving forward. I feel like you are a little sad about this, though, as your hand drops away from this pentacle and this look on your face. You're a little sad leaving this person behind. Um, but, boy, I, I feel like you're actually being saved here. Okay, you are, because if this person comes towards you with an STD, they'll give it to you. So I feel like you're being spared. That's why the door is shutting here. That's why the door is shutting. I feel like this is your protection. I feel like, and you guys know me, right? I always see this, well, not always, but I usually see this as someone new. Because we can't see his face really yet. And this is somebody who's been through a battle, much like the one you've been through. Okay, I see you having a victory here. This person's having a victory as well. And I feel like they may have other options around them or people celebrating them. They could even be in the public eye. But when this, pe when this person comes in and they meet you, they're going to know exactly who it is that they want. They're going to choose you and only you. And overlook every, everybody else, any other opinions. They're going to just want you. Okay? So you've got new love coming towards you as well. Look, and here's that temperance angel. They were trying to help this person. Did you see? Temperance kept trying to come out in this reading while we were talking about your person. But they weren't accepting of this. So the temperance angel is now focused on you. Getting new love for you, right? Mixing up another two of cups. Um, bringing you in this ace of pentacles. A new love that's suited for you, okay? Yeah, it's all coming here. Um, yeah, I hate to say it, Collective, but this person got themselves in some deep, thick trouble. And the door is closing to keep you and your new beginning protected. All right. Anyway, Collective, that's what I've got for this quick reading. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, thank you for your likes, your subscribes, right? And until the next video, take care of you and peace out.